Hey babes and welcome to another video here on my channel. I think that it's been quite a long time since I uploaded a makeup tutorial. Okay, maybe not, but it was quite a long time since I filmed a makeup tutorial. So I'm so excited to be here again in my studio, studio slash bedroom slash <laughs> all over room. No, I have not cut my hair. It's just... It's here, I promise, but I'm thinking I really want to cut it. I've sh like asked you guys on all of my social medias if I should cut my hair to here. Should I? Maybe I should. Oh, I have lip gloss on my teeth. But yeah, this video is just a makeup tutorial. I've been trying out uh, some new products and I've been trying out the new Naked Heat palette from Urban K. I know this is not like brand brand new at the moment, but uh, I've just not had the time to film until now. And I really wanted to use it in a video and I asked you guys and then you wanted to see it. So here it is. And also look at these stars. It's a eyeliner stamp from the body shop. It's my favorite thing in the entire world. I've been having stars around my eyes every single day since I got it and I love it so much. So yeah, if you want to see how I created this look, then just keep watching. All right, so I will start by getting my hair out of the way. And as you guys can see, I have lenses on and they are irritating my eyes. And I also do have some concealer around my mouth. Just so you guys know, if you want to know why, you can click up, up here. Um, but before that, watch this video. <laughs> For foundation, I will use the Body Shop's new Clay Matte Foundation that I do have a first impression on if you would like to see that. And for concealer, I'm using Tarte's Shape Tape in the shade Fair that I have been absolutely loving lately. And to set everything, I'm using IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder in Translucent. And as always, I'm using Kat Von D's Shade of Light Contour Kit. And for blush, I will go in with this Away We Glow Illuminating Powder from NYX Professional Makeup in Summer Reflection. And for highlight, I will go in with this Yeffer Star Skin Frost in Uranus. And for brows, I will use this NYX Precision Brow Pencil in Auburn which is like the perfect red shade for me now that I have red hair. And yes, I know I really need to fix my brows, but another day. <laughs> And now for eyeshadow, I am finally going to use the new Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette that I have now had here at home for like a week, but I have not touched it because I really wanted to do a video using it for the first time. So let's open it up. Ah! I know that this palette has gotten some mixed reviews just because it is a warm toned eyeshadow palette that most people already have in their collection but for me that love warm toned shadows and also I really enjoy Urban Decay's eyeshadow palettes I am super excited about it and it looks gorgeous and it really suits my hair <laughs> first I'm going in with this shade called Sauced in my crease And then I'm going to darken my crease even more with this shade Cayenne. On my lid, I will go in with Dirty Talk on the uh, inner lid and then He Devil in the outer. And I will also use He Devil on the bottom. And 
tend to darken the look even more right in the outer corner I'm going to use this a darker shade And to highlight my inner corner and brow bone, I will go in with the same highlighter that I used on my cheekbones. To do my eyeliner, I will go in with this beautiful star stamp liner from The Body Shop that I have been loving lately and you will see why. In one of the ends, it's just a normal eyeliner that is really, really good, but on the other end, it's just a liner stamp, pretty much, that is shaped like a star. But we are going to start off with just a regular liner and then maybe we will do some stars. I don't think I can not do some stars. <laughs> I didn't do my regular eyeliner, but I, it's not a wing, but I just dragged the eyeliner a little bit out and I think we'll skip wing liner for today. Weird. <laughs> and for lashes, I will go in with these ones and I will have them listed down below. I'm not really sure what they are called at the moment, but I will list them down below as everything else. Before I go in with mascara, I will go in with this new Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Torch. And I will use it in my waterline. And for mascara, I'm using this e.l.f. one that I have no idea what it's called. It just says very black on it. But I can link it down below, of course. And for lipstick, I will go in with Lime Crimes Velveteen in e.l.f. And of course, to finish this look off, I will go in again with the, the Body Shop Star Stamp Liner and do some stars around my eyes because I love it so much. <laughs> I actually think I want to pair it with a gloss, so I will go in with the lip gloss from Anastasia Beverly Hills in Amber. And I also want the lip color to be a little bit more warm, uh, so I think this will make it that. So this is the finished look and I am so excited about it. I think it looks so cool and I absolutely love it with these lenses. Even though on me these lenses does not really, really look brown, which they should be. Truly, I just look like an alien. For some reason, every time I have lenses on that is darker than my natural eye color, I look like an alien. and. Um, you know what, I'm okay with it because I think it looks cute. If you enjoyed this video and uh, you like what I do, then please give this video a like so I know that you enjoyed it. Also, if you have not already subscribed, you should because um, I'm sure you will enjoy it. I will enjoy it and I think you will enjoy it. So yeah, subscribe, like, and I hope we'll see each other in my next video. Bye!